And now for the real Franken story from early cinema. The creation of the first movie star. <laughs> this was done in a very, very um, <laughs> questionable way. It was actually the first ever publicity stunt. In 1908, the talented and beautiful young Florence Lawrence had been turning out two reelers for Biograph Pictures until she began to be noticed by the press. Well, in those days, all the studios, including Biograph, gave no screen credit to their actors, let alone anybody else who worked on the picture. So, Carl Lamely, knowing that Mrs. Lawrence had achieved uh, quite, a, mount, uh, quite a, a bit of celebrity, went over to Biograph and offered her $250 a week <laughs> to be his first star. And he began grooming her as a star attraction and cast her in her first marquee build picture. Well, here's what he did. He leaked a, a story to the press that she was dead. <laughs> and people went crazy. You know, they thought, well, not the biograph girl. She can't be dead. And so miraculously, he, he had been criticizing the same papers that had been running the rumors for being liars and, and such. Sound familiar? <laughs> so uh, they, they all, um, it all, it all came to a head, and uh, he, he miraculously found her alive. And it all coincided, this publicity stunt all coincided with the opening weekend of the picture, Broken Oath, starring Florence Lawrence with her name up in lights. And that's stardom. Your name up in lights. Or your name on the credits after the director, at least. <laughs> But And so after that, well, Florence Lawrence's story is a sad one, it, and it, it mimics um, use, usually the Hollywood version of what happens to young girls when they go to Hollywood. Well, it happened to her. Anyway, the next, <laughs> not funny, the next biograph girl was Mary Pickford, and she made hay with it, and... She got marquee billing, so that after that, and of course at the same time, the theater actors had formed a union and got and won a, a, a salary increase for the, the, the theater owners in court. So it added a little bit of, of fuel to uh, the issue, and uh, Actors were finally given, they formed a union, and they were finally given a decent wage, and their names went in up in lights. And any actor after that that got press got stardom. Press equals stardom, and that's how it happened. That's how it began.